wa gwan views and sub dance la agenda back at it with another video you see me say but before we jump in the video if you're new to this channel please consider liking sharing and also subscribing to the channel hit that notification bell so you guys can be notified whenever we don't upload this you see me say so viewers and sub we see sir p return with another compelling video you see me say giving up information and vibes cartel and if you guys haven't known who sir p is yes He's the man that is speaking on politics watch or a ledge man because we all know the vice change and all of them something there. I bag of something going on with Sir P audio and all of them something there. You see what I mean? Yeah. But from the past weeks, Sir P has been on the trending news in terms of releasing information um, between or about Vibes Cartel and Popcorn and Vibes Cartel wanting to get rid of Popcorn. You see me say, Sir P has been targeting Vibes Cartel. You see me say, giving out information to prove that Vibes Cartel is the biggest snitch in the world. You see me say, people. However, Sir P is now back at it with another video, giving information about Vibes Cartel giving up top killers in Jamaica. You see me say, top killers associated with the Klansman gang. But viewers and sub, the main question that I want to ask, should Vibes Cartel be afraid or scared of the information that Sir P is putting out to the public? Is the information compelling enough to say that, yes, Vibes Cartel should sit back and do not reply to Sir P or to give any hints of responding to Sir P um, message or video that he's putting out whether or not it is true or not and this is my opinion it could be very damaging to Vibes Cartel his career his son's career his family and a whole it's very many people because Sir P is providing not only giving information but is providing evidence it's what I say. I'm here. I'm not sure if the information is accurate. So for me, the, the information is just alleged. For now, because I can't prove that it is true or not. The only person that could come out and say yes, it's true is Vibes Cartel. And until Vibes Cartel come out and say it's true, the information is still alleged. But should Vibes Cartel be afraid of the information that Sir P is putting in the public? I think so. You see what I say? So, um, because the thing with what's going on, Sir P is putting out the information to get a reaction from Vibes Cartel. So far, he has managed to get Vibes Cartel reaction twice, to my knowledge. You see what I say? He, he, he posted a screenshot in one of his earlier videos of Vibes Cartel commenting under one of his videos on YouTube. So Vibes Cartel official YouTube page commenting under the video. And also he made the, the, the same video that he posted a screenshot in, in which he was talking about Vibes Cartel and Popcorn. He, um, he, Vibes Cartel I should say, Vibes Cartel also reacted to that video. But not saying um, reacting to Sir P, it was just like a laugh, like Vi Vibes Cartel, a laugh at the information that he's putting out. You see me say Vibes Cartel didn't deny the information, but he's laughing at it. In which Sir P, who is the narrator of the video, is getting everything that he wanted. He wanted to grab Vibes Cartel's attention. Is where I say people, and being that his arguments are against Vibes Cartel, it's working in his favor. Is where I say, but the information is very damaging. So with that, I feel like Vibes Cartel should just allow this person to talk what he want, or say what he want to say. Is where I say without giving a response or a reaction because 
they say with every action there is a reaction and there is also another action to be carried out afterwards so with Serpy getting the reaction from Vibes Cartel it's gonna compel him to do more videos try to prove I try to do um, put more information in the public to prove that Vibes Cartel is snitching on other um, persons it's what I mean, say criminal persons at that and so far he has managed to provide compelling information and the rate that his channel is growing a lot of persons are showing interest his videos um, his video analytics in terms of views and watch time has spiked over the past couple of weeks all because of that one video that he did providing some evidence in regards to Vibes Carter and Popcorn his video his channel had been growing at a normal pace however ever since he put out that video his channel has been growing significantly he's now over 100k subs so persons are showing interest in his videos persons are showing interest in his um arguments it's a mess of people so with that said i i personally feel that vibes cartel should just allow him to say what he wants to say because if Vibes Cartel haven't responded or reacted to any of his videos, it would have been a different story. You see what I say? We would have just have put out information not knowing that Vibes Cartel is actually seeing or hearing the information. So with getting the response that he has gotten so far from Vibes Cartel, it's actually encouraging him to do more videos trying to expose Vibes Cartel as a snitch or as a criminal member are trying to link Vibes Cartel to various crimes that happen in and around the Kingston Portmore area associated with the Klansman gang yes, you see people and the way that he's putting the information together is convincing to the public and one would want to think and dig deep and try to research more about what really happened you see mr people the the um the law enforcement could also be looking into other stuff other criminal activities and trying to link it to the world the world boss just to see him and we all know so currently he's in prison facing life and who could tell them probably come up with one of that story say hey vibes cartel they link to this and a vibes cartel make this happen you see mr people so I personally feel that Vibes Cartel should just allow him to speak and vent and provide any information that he wants to provide. But Vibes Cartel shouldn't react or respond to anything. Because with the reaction that Vibes Cartel is giving so far, is making more persons or people uh, more interested in Sir P's videos and content. Viewers and sub. What do you guys think? Do you think that Vibes Cartel should keep responding? Do you think that Vibes Cartel should respond in a different way? Do you think that Vibes Cartel sh um, should come out and deny all these allegations that are, are put towards him and put against him? Yeah man, let me know what you think. Drop a comment in the comment section. And say, say, my views on this is that I personally feel like Vibes Cartel should just stop responding on a whole just allow him to say what he wants to say because he now has the platform he's not he now has the viewership and he's gonna continue to make compelling videos providing additional evidence because we as the viewers we do not know what's going on in the inner circle in terms of uh, what's going on in around the gang circle and the persons that are um, associated with these crimes it's a message. Persons in in the area would know, but we, um, the persons that are on the outside, do not know what's happening. So, with him providing those evidence, it's gonna seem compelling to us, and we would more lead towards in his information than to be leaning on a vibes cartel side. So, I think that vibes cartel should just resist from responding, allow him to do what he wants to do because. 
the vibes cartel respond again it's gonna encourage him to put more information in the public which is very damaging to vibes cartel his career and it could affect his sons and family just to see him you see what I say, people but we are in the video right so um leave a comment in the comment section you see what I say? let me know what you guys think share your opinion on the topic just to see him you see what I say? and if you're new to this channel remember for like share subscribe hit that notification bell so you guys can be notified whenever I do want to upload this. You know what I'm saying? I'm out.